Hi, I'm Pooja Mohan and welcome to my writing studio. I'm working on a collection of personal essays. Take my experiences and write it in such a way that all kinds of people can relate to it. I'm not sure when or if I'll publish them. What I want to do with this is work on my storytelling skills. Over the past month, I took a couple of workshops on Skillshare. No, this video is not sponsored by them in any way. If you saw the video on my goals, you'll know that I was scheduled to take some in-person workshops, which didn't happen because of everything that's going on. So I substituted for some online workshops and I took this workshop by an essayist, Megan Dong. And now I want to practice what I learned in this workshop. Right now I'm calling this just a collection of personal essays. I don't have a name for this project right now. And neither do I have a set number of essays that I want to write. We'll see how it goes. Last week, I brainstormed a couple of incidences from my personal life that I feel will make entertaining essays. And I want to see how I do when I apply all the things that I learned in this workshop. I have structured the essays in the way Megan Dawn does in her essays. And so now all I have to do is write. Easy peasy. Well, we'll find out. I'd love to know what you're working on. Let me know in the comments below. I'll be doing three writing sprints of 20 minutes each and I'll see you on the other side of the first sprint. Megan points out in her workshop that nothing happens in a vacuum and any incident will have the point of view of the storyteller. I found that incredibly freeing while writing. So even though what I'm writing about involves real people, it's not about them. It's about how I perceived it as the person I was then and how I look at it now when so many years have gone by and I have some distance from it. It's coming together quite effortlessly. I'll get to my second 20 minutes writing sprint. I have set the timer on my Tide app and I'll see you on the other side. I'm trying to get the piece to fit into a larger truth, a universal truth that we all share. So for example, when someone says that they are a 90s kid, anyone who's grown up in the 90s can immediately resonate with that person at some level. So that's what I want to get to with this essay. Okay, the timer is set and on to the next sprint.
I finished. I'm done with this draft. I think I have the intellectual hook. I'll read through it now and make notes and then I'll let it sit and get back to it later. I'll continue to write one essay every weekend until the end of the month. So by the end of May, I should have four essays written. That'll be incredible. And then I'll work on the revisions and the self-edit. If you're interested in the workshop that I've been talking about, check the description below. I have the link to it there. I hope you like this behind the scene of how I write and about this writing project. If you'd like to know how I self-edit, check out this video or this one and I'll see you in the next one.